guys, we are here in Pigeon Forge, and we are at the, what, three-story ropes course? That's right. That's David right. Ware is with us. He is the mayor of Pigeon Forge and spends a lot of his time here at the island. So many activities to do. And I'm proud of you. We just got off the Ferris wheel, and you're like, oh, no, no, no. Neither one of us are chicken and out. That's We're right. jumping on this We're thing. We're going to the top. That's right. Tell us about what this, this is and the climbing and how it is safe for everybody, right? That's right. You're tethered in. It's, it's, it's safe. It's 40 stories. 40 feet, and you're, it's, it's a ropes challenge course. So what's really cool about this is you see folks on the ground who are not sure they want to get up there, and when they get up there, they overcome their fears, they overcome the challenge, and they feel great about themselves. And you see it every day. And it also helps when you have your children who are at the very top going, come on, Mom, you big chicken, right? That's right. A little peer pressure never hurts. A little peer pressure. All right, let's you and I try to take this one on. Now, each one of these are different, and it really is key to, like, hold on to what you're tethered to here, right? That's right. So what makes this one, you said, Deanne, this one's pretty easy. What makes this one so much easier? This one is easy because it's more stable than the rest of them. So you can walk pretty easily on these planks. So this challenge is pretty good for a beginner, but we'll go up further, I think. <laughs> Are you calling me a beginner? <laughs> Wait, aren't we on second story by now? Oh, look at me, I'm holding on. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. This is this is a lot of fun. And you want me to go across this one now? Oh yeah, that's the plank. Well, we what do you do hold? What do you hold on to? Or how to, about this one? To your tether. You can do that. We okay. Can hold on to the rope. Let, let's make this one a little more simple. Now, the cool part too, way over there somewhere, there's a place to zip line. That's right. There's two zip lines on this course, which is really neat. One's at the very top, third third floor, third story, and the other one's on the second. And you can see some guys doing it right now. It's pretty neat to free fly, free fall through the. Through the air on the zip line. And clearly, this isn't just for the little kids. Absolutely not. When you get up to the top, you'll you realize you, you probably need a little bit of bravery to get to get over, overcome some nerves. <laughs> okay. Well, we're gonna wrap this up by hopefully walking across this. I mean, I tell you, not a lot makes me nervous. This does make it. me shaking my shoes a little bit. So check out Pigeon Forge and the island here. So many different activities for you. And the kiddos, places to eat, places to shop. I'm Deanne Stevens, out and about in Pigeon Forge today. Back to you guys. Holy cow.